At first here at noon, we're working the very latest on a massive mill fire in Fall River. It's a story that we've been on top of since breaking it first on WPRI.com yesterday. This is aerial footage of the four alarm fire that raced through the vacant mill. Right now, fire crews are still on scene and they're dousing hot spots. Right now, Stephen Schuler has the latest for us. As we've learned, the fire is considered suspicious, Stephen. That's right, and nearly 24 hours after that fire broke out, crews remain inside the facility here. Now, this is the old Duro manufacturing facility, and we're told firefighters are still dousing hot spots inside. Now, we did speak with the fire chief, the district fire chief, in just the past hour, and he tells us federal investigators have arrived on scene to try and help pinpoint a cause of this suspicious fire. Flames shoot from the windows of this Fall River mill where a massive four alarm blaze burned for hours Tuesday afternoon. Firefighters fought hot spots through the night and investigators returned this morning searching for clues in a fire they now call suspicious. We're looking at um, different possibilities right now. Uh, we know that in the past we've had some vandals inside here. Eyewitness News has learned the mill's owner recently hired contractors to board up the building and put overnight police details in place to prevent recent acts of vandalism. Only our cameras gained access behind the mill Wednesday, where fire investigators are focusing their inspection. They're looking from, they go from the burns, uh, the unburned side to the burned side, they're checking the, uh, so they can find the actual origin. Okay, and then from the origin, they look for anything that um, that could be, um, you know, any in inflammable materials or something like that. We've learned representatives from the Federal Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco, Firearms, and Explosives are now assisting Fall River Fire Prevention and the State Fire Marshal's Office with the investigation. Fire officials tell us the city's building inspector is now working with the mill's owner to decide what's next for the complex. Parts of the building, I believe, are going to be taken down, but um, uh, right now, as as uh, as I understand, the, the main mill is going to be standing. Now, we are told uh, two firefighters were hospitalized as a result of the fire, but at this point, it appears their uh, injuries were not too serious. Now, the chief tells me fire investigators will continue to work here until they pinpoint that cause, but he says there's no idea to know when that will happen. For now, live in Fall River with the Southeastern Massachusetts Mobile Newsroom, I'm Stephen Schuler, Eyewitness News.